Welcome to H2I Group's series detailing common issues with your universal laser system. Let's get started. All ULS lasers are equipped to be connected to either standard 110 or 220 volt power sources. Assuming everything is working as it should, your ULS laser should be distributing power to the rest of the machine evenly and accurately. However, power issues can occur in a variety of circumstances. The most common cause of a power failure is improper or irregular surges in electricity from your source. The power boxes inside of the machine are designed to handle variances of power within the machine. They're also equipped with immediate safety fuses should there be a surge. While unlikely, even these safety features cannot be enough, and you will need a new power box for your laser to function again. As a preventative measure, make sure that your power outlets are up to code and stable. Do not use ungrounded outlets or a converter box with this machine, as the ground cable is the fundamental safety feature all electrical products use for surging. If you are lucky enough to catch when the problem first starts, you may notice a machine make a popping sound when it first turns on. This may be a poor connection leading to an electrical arc, the initial fuse is blowing, or a capacitor inside of the power box receiving a surge. Indications of a power failure may include Machine does not turn on. Power turns on, but laser does not fire. X, Y, or Z movement does not work. Without an in-depth knowledge of electrics, we do not recommend you attempt an in-depth diagnosis and or attempt to fix the power banks. Without such knowledge, there is a risk to damage other electronics in your machine and a possible fire hazard in severe circumstances. If you suspect your ULS system is suffering from a power issue, we highly recommend a professional come and accurately diagnose this.